Check the tension and condition of the belt around the compressor pulley. An air conditioning compressor uses quite a lot of power, so a loose belt or one glazed from slippage in the past may not be driving the compressor properly. Check the condenser to make sure that it is not clogged with mud or leaves, which will prevent it from radiating to the outside the heat collected from the inside of the vehicle. The fins on the condenser can be cleaned with water and a stiff brush if necessary. Check that the flexible hoses to the various components of the air conditioning system are not cracked or soft or brittle and that they are connected securely with no obvious signs of leakage or corrosion around the connections. Some of the hoses may be metal pipes. Check that these rigid lines are securely fixed in their routing positions and also look for signs of leakage at their connections. Some lubricating oil circulates with the refrigerant in an air conditioning system, so look for wet stains around all the hose connections, as well as around the gaskets on the compressor, as these may also indicate refrigerant leakage. Start the engine and then switch on the air conditioner. You should hear a firm click as the compressor clutch engages. Set the blower fan to high and check whether the air coming out of the vents inside the vehicle feels cool. Then switch the fan to its lowest setting and use a stem dial thermometer to compare the ambient temperature with the cooler air coming out of the air conditioning system. The difference should generally be around 20 degrees Fahrenheit or 11 degrees Celsius although this will vary with different outside temperatures. Let the engine run at around 1500 RPM with the air conditioner on for 5 to 10 minutes. Then feel the hoses on each side of the compressor. The high side or outlet hose of the compressor should feel significantly hotter than the low side or inlet hose. Hello. Everyone has a business website these days, but few have a business YouTube video that can be embedded into your website. YouTube business videos are the most powerful marketing tools today, yet the most underused. Starting at just $200, MLS Pro Videos can produce your YouTube video starting at just $200. We can use your photos, or use stock video footage, or come to your place of business and shoot your video in high def, widescreen, including voiceover, music, and much more. Please visit our website and see some videos that we've done at www.mlsprovideos.com, or call me at 541-531. 3691. Thanks for watching. I am Bill Kiefer. Until next time. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Bill Kiefer. We are MLSProVideos.com. We do YouTube videos for individuals, events, and business. Again, thank you very much for watching. Until next time, goodbye. Thank <laughs> you.